So I'm passing the phone to somebody who can't live without pink. <laughs> All right, that's fair. I'm passing the phone to a person who can't go a day without eggs. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm passing the phone to someone who brought a teddy bear into Big Brother house. Oh! I don't like that. Here you come. Let's go. I'm passing the phone to a person who vented about his feelings the whole week. Oh! Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay, okay. I'm passing the phone to someone whose social media was not active throughout Big Brother. Oh, who does that? Wow. <laughs> I don't have a choice. I don't have a phone. Um, now I'm going for the jugular. Oh. I'm passing the phone to a person who only has one dance. Oh! What only dance is this? The leg one. <laughs> oh my god. That's only dance. Good one. I'm passing the phone to someone who loves Nigeria more than her country. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're trying to get me kicked out of my country. It's cool. It's fine. South Africa, that's not true. <laughs> okay. Mm. I'm passing the phone. To a person who hid eggs in a pot plant. Ah! <laughs> you say. Oh my god! Plant. You can't call. You can't say that because you hid it with eggs. me. I was you sleeping. Were, you were no. my partner. You were no, my no, partner. No, no, no. We no. did together. I was not there. I was sleeping. I was sleeping. I was right sleeping. I was right sleeping. Support. Uh -uh. No. Support, support system. Game. I'm passing the phone to someone who complains about the heat in Nigeria, <laughs> but gets angry when you turn on the air conditioner. <laughs> This person, this person, look, it's off, it's off, it's been off. Yo, I'm hot in here. All because of her. God. In my defense, guys, Marvin blast the aircon. In my defense, yeah, Nigeria is hot. <laughs> guys, he puts it on white people gold, guys. Look, I'm hot in here. Look, it's off, it's been it's off. It's my turn, it's my turn, it's my turn. I'm passing the phone to a person who has more connections than a cell than a cell phone service. <laughs> oh my God, Mister Connection, eh? Mister oh. Connection, he has more connections than MTN, guys. <laughs> he's a he's a hotspot. Where's my phone? Every time I want service, I just come to Marvin like yeah. this. <laughs> I'm passing the phone to someone who has come to take over my my house. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> It's all hard now. Look, look. I'm passing a phone to a visitor that thinks it's now her place. This, this. First of all, in my defense, he said feel at home, and that's what I did. Feel at home. I'm passing the phone to a person who washes his hair every freaking day. Ah. Who does that? This nigga you washes his hair it. every day. Oh every day. God. No black person does that, oh. Marvin. This nigga washes his hair every day, guys. Because every, you have to. You have to wash your hair. Not every day. Yeah. What kind of danger are you fighting with? Huh? Huh? Like what? I'm passing the phone to someone who doesn't wear anything but heels. How do you wear only high heels? That's all she wears all the time. Even in Big Brother, she brought only high heels to the house. I'm heels protect. all the time. All the time. I'm yo, protect. yo, I'm yo. Protect. That's hard. I feel attacked, but it's fine. I'm passing the phone uh, to a person mm. who showers for one hour uh, every day. Guys, you know, no matter what I'm having waste. You shower the same. No, I you don't. I have makeup. I have to do my makeup. Yo, what are you doing in the shower? You shower for like one hour and you shower like 59 minutes. Why is this nigga doing thing. in the shower same for thing. over an hour? <laughs> Underwater. What's trouble? What's troubling you, Marvin? Come tell the truth. Tell us your problems so same we can solve them. Same thing. Tell us. You show it. You have to tell your problem too. It's the same. I have makeup. It's the same. I have makeup. I'm a girl and no, I have makeup. I do no, not shower for now. Marvin showers for one hour. So I'm gonna stop drilling you because I <laughs> won already. By the way, I won. I won. I won. I won because I all this. Look at Aruje. Come on. Who? Look at Aruje. Look at Aruje. Look at Aruje. Bro, I won. Come on now. I won. You guys need to give my credit. Give my credit where it belongs. No. One and the only king, Yemi Grex, is in the building. <laughs>
Yemi, Yemi, how are you doing now? Hope you are fine. I'm sure lots of you stopped watching after Yemi Grex left. Hmm, this guy know they too smile, but it's well. Yes, so Auntie Jenny, oh my dear, my dear, how are you? Like after she left the house, this babe just went back to where she came from. She don't even go to Nigeria. <laughs> And she said that, that after the show, she's not going to Nigeria, that she will just go straight to where she came from. Well, it's well. She's looking pretty, even though we know it's camera. The one and the only Oli Oli in town. Oh, the beautiful fashionista. Ah, ah. Oli Oli is in town. Okay, guys, let's keep on moving. Someone wrote saying, Big Brother Niger is bigger than Big Brother Mzanzi, South Africa. I agree. I mean, Nigerians have more fan base than South Africans when it comes to reality shows, especially Big Brother. Comparing the last seasons of Big Brother Niger and Big Brother Mzanzi, Mufambadi won one Big Brother Mzanzi, wife now won Big Brother Niger. I bet most of you don't even know Unfo Save. Yeah, majority do not even know who Unfo is. Um, Taban said one thing that housemates from Big Brother Mzanzi are treated like influencers in South Africa. I heard him say that one day in the house, but in Nigeria, we, did, we treat our Big Brother Niger celeb. A big brother Niger housemates are celebrities because being in that house is not easy at all. But it's not be easy being in that house, knowing fully well that camera is all over you. Camera is watching you while you're sleeping, whatever you're doing, camera is on you. Big brother titans were just created to unite South Africans and Nigerians together because we are one in Africa. Yeah. Big brother titans is going to end this month and big brother reunion uh, would follow after the reunion the bb niger season eight of uh, the season eight of bb niger is going to start we are eating good shows this year 2023 i cannot even wait for the show to start for you know the season eight to start yeah from union to season eight from season eight to bb titan again i love that so much like i so much love that Okay, Marvin was like missing Yvonne and the cozy God keep them in the house for me. Ooh, okay, he is indirectly saying that you guys should please vote for Yvonne and the cozy for them to still remain in the house. Thank you. Oh, coming from Glory, the way cozy stuffs are food. <laughs> Her face with food, packs it in her mouth, and she's with so much squat energy. Jeez, miracle wasn't wrong. Like she even accepted that you know she's a bricklayer. Like she accepted it that she's a bricklayer. But that's true, eh? My dear, eh, food the sweet too. Like eh, food the sweet. Ah, if you put food for your mouth like this, say the shoe and Jehovah, food the sweet. Don't forget. So I'm not even angry that she's doing those things. Ah, uh, Twitter record was like, Tabat, I'm going nowhere on Sunday. He's here to play the finale, but then again, Tibangat, it's your vote. Like I will say, it's your vote that counts. Are you guys voting? I'm doing my best to <laughs> make on a vote. So, are you done voting? Have you voted? How many votes do you give Taban? Come here on Sunday and be crying, you know. <laughs> my Taban no go go shower. I bet make on a vote, yeah. Why are these girls intimidated by Kosi so much? All of them, you know, Ipelen thinks Kosi wants miracle, Tati thinks she wants Kanaga, but Blue thinks she wants black. Uh, <laughs> you know, uh, um, miracle is close to Kosi, Kanaga same to Kosi, black boy the same thing. So why would they feel intimidated? They would do. Like, if now you not go feel like that. You know, girls are jealous, but I don't think Kosi would want, you know, Kanaga. Not that she wouldn't want Kanaga, but Kanaga is with someone right now. So, okay. Hmm. If that should happen, Yemi Grex. Hey, the king of Grex. <laughs> I got a channel talk. Oh. That one go swallow Kanaga alive. <laughs> Like Blue talking about uh, boundaries, does she know the meaning of boundaries? So she can use the word on Kosi after all what she did with Yemi, knowing Kosi was in the play. You really can't take what you did. She's lucky it's just friendship and toothbrush. <laughs> uh, you know, say, uh, sometimes uh, when they do things, you go the sweet, you go the sweet, but when they do you back, <laughs> when they do you back, <laughs> Hey, God, when she was doing to her own to go see, she didn't say uh, she's the real game player. Okay, well, now Kosi is friends with Blackie. <laughs> very good friends with Black Boy. Very, very good friends with Black Boy. Okay, well. 
Okay, make we just they go, they go. Mm -hmm. Everyone supporting color should be ashamed of her right now. Who are you to set boundaries with your man when you are a homewrecker yourself? Can she just get evicted on Sunday? She just annoys me. Well, yeah, she's a sweet girl. I won't deny that, okay? But then again, like I said, do me, I do you. God, no go vex. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Even self man, no go vex. So... Uh, the song was the song wasn't uh, sung by me. It was sung by someone. I think it was Peace Square or something like that. If not Peace Square, it's Flavor. I think so. So my people, my people, make one just allow and make we just the pass they go. Sunday is fast approaching and the voting lines will be closed tomorrow because tomorrow is Thursday. So let's move. Taba was like, yo, I'm really fighting these demons, you know, because see, you know, <laughs> Bubu was telling me that me and Yemi were like an old couple because of how much we used to resolve our issues. I, this girl. See, honestly, yeah. Then, yeah, I agree. Like, they look like old couples. I see, eh? Ah, God. Don't be old one, no. We make a channel talk on because some people come after me and say, Cynthia, how do you know that they look like old couple? <laughs> ah, I beg I cannot talk on because sometimes it's, it's just that, yeah, they look mature, they are well matured, you know, when they're handling all these kind of issues. But then again, you know, calling someone into your matter at times, you know, the jig, you know, jig, you know, jig. I thought I was done with the show, but there is something about Kanaga Junior that I like. I will stick with him from now, dude, is the whole vibe. Oh, Nana, you know. Mm. Who not like the video? See now, KJ through the handkerchief. The video, <laughs> me miss you. <laughs> Match is going up. Anyways, guys, drop your comments in the comment section. Who wouldn't even like the video if I may ask if? Who no, who no go like him? Well, anyways, you, know, you must not like everybody, right? Yeah, everybody get their own choice and everything. Thanks for watching, guys. Please drop your comments in the comment section. What you guys have to say from A to Z? Which housemate are you missing? Like, which housemate are you missing? And which housemate do you think would be leaving on Sunday? Drop your comments down below. Thank you once again. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't done that. Bye.